not me not paying attention to y'all. I love y'all for real. You know, I feel like crying, you guys. I've been crying for the past couple of days. I cannot believe they tried to break into my car. We're not playing no fucking games tonight. When I get drunk, one thing about me, the tongue's gonna come out. Ooh. I feel like Jay Khaled. These days, I'm letting guy handle all things above me. The things I can't change are the reason you love me. Listen, you can hear them calling my name. I'm all over the place. I can't sit in one place. I'm not ashamed. I'm here, about to get my lashes done, and my camera's about to die. I'm pissed. Why couldn't my camera tell me that before I left the house? But anyways, welcome to the vlog. This vlog is gonna be about me and my roommate going to go see Drake. I'm so excited. So getting ready begins today. We're starting with lashes and nails. And I'm getting my eyebrows done. Tomorrow I'm getting my hair done. Um, and then it'll just be done. <laughs> and then the next time you see me after that will be like the day of. I'm excited. We got the set list for everything. The concert looks amazing. Production looks amazing. So I'm just excited. And I cannot wait until we get to see him perform live and our seats are pretty close so I'm happy about that yeah Rovell's clips baby still finding myself let alone a soulmate I'm just saying feel like we want in the same our relationship changed that already never existed she says you're my everything I love you through everything I done did everything to her We're about to go right now and start my lashes. I've done eight and everything. I've been here since 9.30 a.m. So we're gonna do these bad boys next. I want them long with spikes. I'll show you guys when it's done. Okay, here are the lashes. They're so pretty. Nails and lashes are done for Drake. I was thinking about going to go get my toes done this afternoon because I need toes done. I'm headed home now, so I'll see y'all later. Okay, you guys, look at my crazy hair. Um, I don't know what to do about, like, if it puffs up. I'm gonna tell her I blow dry it, but the heat just made it puffy. But yes, uh, I kind of signed off with you guys yesterday without really signing off with you guys yesterday. So right now, I'm about to, ooh, it's hot. The Lord is hot. Right now, I'm headed to go get my hair done. I'm so excited, so I made sure I put on a little face, a little cute fit, um, so that when my hair is done, I could like feel really cute. I could see how it really is gonna look, you know? Cause I haven't had a closure in a really long time. Oh my God, I'm sweating. Y'all don't look. Look at that. I'm about to go right now. My appointment is, is at uh, 12, and it is, what time is it? 12.05, so I'm lay laying a little bit. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go and we're gonna go get this hair done. I'm letting guy in the thing. Okay, you guys. So I'm here. I'm just early as shit. I think I got here at like 11 20, 11 18, something like that. I was outside waiting, listening to music and stuff. All I know is I'm excited for my hair to be done. It's been mad long. Like, look, she needs desperately. She needs desperately to be done. It's just been too long. I've been weaveless since, I wanna say March, like bundles. I took my hair out in March-ish to go ahead and get the braids for our cruise. And then I got the braids for, cru for the cruise. I kept them in for like three weeks, three, four weeks, cause they get messy very easily. And then I took them out, and then ever since I took them out, I've just been wearing my natural hair. I have not put no weave back in my hair. And I think part of it is because I just don't feel like doing my own hair anymore. In the last vlog, I literally said that. I bought tracks to put tracks in, but I ended up never doing it because I was just like, mm, I don't want to. So right now, I'm getting my hair professionally done, and I'm pretty nervous about it. I don't get my hair professionally done. I always do my hair, and that's why maybe I'm burnt out from doing my hair and that's why I don't want to do it. The reason why I don't go to professionals is because they never do it the way I want them to do it. They never do it the way I envision it in my head. So like, it's hard. Braids are different. For me, I think braids are like a little bit easier in a way because braids look like braids, you know what I mean? Versus getting like an install and 
it's just not as not the way I want it to be I'm gonna leave it at that her work does look very good though I'm not even too worried about that Yanni and I plan to go to the movies after this but she's getting her hair done today around like three now I really wanted to watch Little Mermaid I'm yet to watch that movie although I really want to watch it I'm on my period and I tend to cry a lot like I cry a lot when it comes up to certain stuff I know for a fact that um, I will cry during that movie and I don't feel like crying you guys I've been crying for the past couple of days for no reason like for dumb stuff and I just don't feel like crying also I got this new light let me see if I can turn it on did it even make a difference don't piss me off I think if it was dark out here it would make a difference y'all see that y'all see that yeah I'm gonna try to sneak this into the Drake concert they say no flash photography and shit like Fuck, what the fuck y'all mean? I'm gonna record the whole thing on my phone anyways. Just kidding, I ain't got enough space for that. We wanna get there really early cause I wanna take pictures, drink, eat, and then we wanna like comfortably walk to our seats. Have enough time to run back and put this light in the car in case they tell me like, girl, get the fuck on with that. And I'm bringing my little slides which I'm low-key kind of scared about. I'm thinking about just buying a little sneakers to put on because I don't want no one stepping on my toes and fucking my shit up. Can you imagine? I have pretty toes, you guys. I would hate to have to um, bop somebody in the head if they step on my shit. I feel like I've talked a lot. I will either see you guys when my hair is done or I will like record a little bit of, you know, what my hair is looking like during the process. Okay, okay. Guys, hair is done. Look how pretty it is. She did a good job. Laced by Maya. Check her out. Info down here. Alright, you guys. Does she look different from a few clips ago? You guys saw the whole hair process. It looks so good. This right here feels like it's like sticking up, but I think after sleeping on it for a little bit, it should be fine. I feel like a different bitch, like Please, I feel like Jay Khaled. I feel like Jay Khaled, yeah. I feel cute as fuck. The hair is really good. I hate that I had such a bad experience with the vendors. It is what it is. Um, getting my hair done was really nice. Everything just was really nice. I like her a lot, she's cool. And she's a young woman doing her thing. So I definitely want to continue to support her moving forward. Hair check, lashes check, nails check. But I'm about to go get some gas and then see, you know, what's out there to do. Think about what to get. I want something really like small to have before I go and get my Thai food. So I've been thinking about this Thai food all week. It's felt, it feels like it's been forever. We're, we're headed off, you guys. I will see you guys in our next destination, which is at home. And I think I'm gonna take my roommate to her hair appointment because she says hers is at 3.30, a little over an hour from now. So I'm gonna head home. Should be time to go by the time I get there. Okay, totally. This is kinda, this is kinda cunt. This eat. Nah, this hair is like really good, you guys. Alien superstar with, with, uh, two sexy folks. <laughs> Forever, I'm your girl. Give you diamonds and pearls. Oh, baby. Uh. Just came back from the movies. We watched Transformers. That movie was really good. I give it a 9.5 out of 10. Check it out. Really good. I loved it. Dropped off Yanni to do her hair. Cause she's getting ready. You know, we gotta get ready for my baby daddy Drake. <laughs> what, two more days to go? Two or three more days to go? Super excited. Oh my God, you're on my stomach. Oh, I ate too much. I did also show you guys my hat for Beyonce. Well, I didn't show you guys on YouTube. I showed a TikTok. But half of the people on TikTok are on my YouTube, but this is my Beyonce hat. Ooh, ooh, it's just under here. I wanted it to be black, so it's cute as fuck. Alien superstar, whip, whip, 
My Beyonce's outfit, that one's coming together soon. I just needed to get Drake's down and then I have time to do Beyonce's, but I know what I'm gonna wear, I have it planned out. I will see you when I'm gonna pick up Yanni and we'll do her hair reveal then as well. And later. All right, babe, get in. Get in, get in, get in. I got a proposition. Okay. And I don't want you to say no. <laughs> I want you to say yes. So my friend messaged me and he said he got a section at Frame and Llama and he wants us to pop out. When? Tonight. <laughs> I know you want to get on the game and all this other stuff, but we're young. It's 9.45 though. What time will we have to get there? He said 11. I want to get there 11.30. Okay. Bad bitches never show up on time. So. And you know, what are the odds that we all got our hair done now? And that's why I want to go! If it was one day later, y'all, if I was getting my hair done tomorrow, it would be a fuck no. Catch you next time, baby. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and her hair looks so cute. I'm Thank like you. in love with it. Her first time with butterfly locks. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love it. She did so. a really good job. She, but she always does a good job. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, you know, I guess we'll go out for a little bit tonight. Ah! <laughs> my room is a mess like don't look at it don't look at it so we're about to go out right now getting ready i think y'all know that i said i wanted to get there at 11 30 because the guy said they're gonna be there at 11 i'm not trying to be there too long i want to dress up take pictures act like i had a good time not act really have a good time like i'm about to do my makeup right now the face is beat as you can tell we're gonna hope that this is at least trying to lay a little nicely because I need to fix the beat up here. So I'm gonna hit it with this that I got. And it's laying, so that's really good. Um, I don't know what's gonna happen once I get inside the club though. I know for a fact that's a different story. Okay, it's fixed y'all. It was, it was looking rough before. All right, so anyways, yeah, let's get dressed. Adam, here, her, her. Very okay, cute. We gotta go, it's cute though. Hey <laughs> <Okay>, y'all, <Ooh. laughs> I got a little see-through ensemble going on. I got my heels here, cause I just don't feel like putting them on right now. It's hot as hell, so I'll do it in the car, but yeah, you know, I'm gonna go have a good time. My bed convinced me to go out, of course. I said yes, I didn't even hesitate. We'll see y'all when we get there, bye. Oh my god, there's a piece of hair in my eyeball. I can't get it out. Oh my god. Thank you. <laughs> Alright you guys, we just got here. It's hot as fuck. Um, I don't really have much to say other than it's hot as fuck. And we about to go inside. Alright, you have anything to say, Miss Yanni? No, let's go. She looks so pretty. Out. Okay, Thank let's go. Too. Bye guys. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Too fly, we gotta go home. Showing too much ass <laughs> and shaking too much ass. Okay. What's up? I got 18 hours. What's your name? My name is Smoke. Okay. What's your Instagram? Shout out to the ladies. Period. Yeah. 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 Tell the ladies if you single. If you single, you single. He is him. We don't know if he's single, but he's him. The king of New Britain. I live in New Britain my whole life. I ain't never heard of you before. <laughs> But yeah, we finna go home. It was lit. It was a good time. It was hot as hell. But you know, we some hot girls. We had our heels on. The whole time. Could never. Could never. Could never. Could never. Could never. Could never. All night. Period.
Period. Period. I'm gonna stop doing shenanigans, okay? Next time you see me, we gonna be waking up tomorrow morning. I'm a bug with you. Bruh. All right, we out here. Nitty, come on, come on, Nitty. Take your shot, Gigi, period. Y'all, look how gorgeous she is. She's so pretty. Oh my God. She pretty in our real life. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> you taking a shot? What is this? Don Julio. Woo! Let's go, let's go, let's go. Period. <laughs> Not me drunk as hell. This mark is right. Yeah. We outside for real. Yeah. Girl. Almost, almost. Tell me if my roommate is not a baddie. Period. Don't listen. If you gas me up, it's okay. gonna stay. It's gonna be permanent. Okay. What's up, Raquan? He's too cool for school. Look at him. <laughs> Look at him. He's too cool for school. What's up? What's up? Yanni, we out here. What the fuck? Look, it just so happened to work out the chain of events, right? So, I was supposed to get my hair done at three. It got pushed back. We went to the movies and saw Trans. Amen. It worked out. She hit me up right after the movies. It was like, I could do your hair. Amen. Got my hair done, and then she hit me up like, oh, we outside. Amen. Went, got home, Dry came outside, boot. got Dry lit. Don't fuck up the veneers. <laughs> Where the niggas at? Okay. I'm trying to get my coochie scratch. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all know we acting bad. I'm turning this off, okay? But you can see me. You see my face, right? One thing, one thing about me and my bed, we gonna have a good time. And we gonna flirt with some man. Cause that's just what we do. <laughs> I guess I'll see you guys in another time. I keep saying like, ooh, I'm gonna see you tomorrow, ooh, and then come back. But I'm for real this time. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Bye. Okay, you guys, uh, what is up? It's the next day. <laughs> It is minutes to 12. I think it's 11.47 right now, 11.46. So I'm gonna head to my baby cousin's christening. I miss them. I wish I could show you what I'm wearing, but I got this dress from Old Navy and I'm wearing some slippers and that's it. My lace was lifting last night, as y'all know. I messaged my uh, lace technician, my hairstylist, and asked her if I could come in. Um, she said yeah and was wondering when I wanted to come in. So hopefully I can do that today. I'm gonna buy some Isha Bond because that works with me way better than Ghost Bond. I just want it fixed so that it, it looks good for Drake. That's all I care about. Later today we gotta go to um, Ulta, get some stuff for the concert and just get some stuff in general. I'm gonna put some money out and I don't even know what else. So come along with us, come along with us. Mind you, this is all getting ready for Drake. This is what this vlog is about, Drake. We just happened to be at the club last night, period. It's cool in my car now, I'm about to drive off later. Okay, you guys, Um, I don't even remember the last time y'all saw me. Did you see me Sunday? My phone died on Sunday, so I couldn't really vlog the whole entire day. I only got like pieces of it and stuff. But anyways, that's besides the point. I had to go and get my lace fixed because it was lifting and my chemistry is something about my um my sweat and my oils that just don't mix with ghost bond or bold hold so we it just got to sweating real bad yanni needs to get some food because she needs to make food i said i was gonna go grocery shopping because i needed stuff for the week but i think i'll be okay because when we come back on wednesday i mean we're coming back same night tuesday night but wednesday i'm about to cook and that's wednesday thursday friday saturday like i'm good i get paid on friday so that will be good turn my bitch up turn my tt turn my I don't know. I'm going on a tangent. I'm just so excited. So today we're supposed to go get the nips as well. So we're going to go get the nips. I think I'm going to let Yanni drive because I just hit my dad's car by accident. <laughs> it didn't get messed up, okay? I just like bumped it. Bumped it a little bit. And I called him and I was like, I think it hit your car. I don't know. I think I hit your truck. I don't know. I don't know. And he was like, come out. We'll get out the car and check. And I was like, I'm scared. I don't want to. And he was like, well, how are you gonna know? So then when Yanni came downstairs, I asked her to check. I said, look, did I hit my daddy's car? And she looked and she was like, 
no and i was like okay and then my dad called our neighbor and our neighbor was outside at the time with his wife in their car <laughs> And when I hit it, I'm like, fuck, I know they seen that shit. I know they seen that shit. I told my dad that. My dad called them. He was like, did Jada hit my shit? And they started laughing. And why the neighbor said that he was going to snitch anyways? Little does he know I'm an honest daughter. I'm honest. Very honest. I'm about to just chill for the rest of the night. And just do me. I don't know what else I can say. Hey, girl. Hey, y'all. What y'all doing? <laughs> I, I seen you vlogging before I got in the car, and I'm like, looking at you. Period. <laughs> We're vlogger girls. I was just catching them up on our uh, doings and our don'ts. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I want you to drive today. I'm embarrassed. When? When we leave the liquor store? Yeah. Okay. I, I told them that story, too. <laughs> But yeah, yeah she hitting cards, y'all. Hide your kids. No! She hitting everybody. Else. No! I'm a good driver, I swear. I feel like when, when you do one wrong thing driving, you feel like that fucks up your whole Literally driving record. Your whole career of driving. <laughs> so we got the goods. I wanted to try the Stella Rose pineapple. I love pineapple anything. D-Lo calls me pineapple. That's my nickname. I love pineapple. So that. And then I got the mango cut water. The mango margarita. So we're going to be turned up. My big got the red, white, and blue Smirnoff. Nips. And then. And then we both got the Smirnoff pink lemonade. So that should be real good. Mm -hmm. Ah, Drake, we coming with you. We coming to see you, baby. Him and Sir 21. Sir 21 of London, of London England. <laughs> the man himself. I'm, I'm excited. We getting geared up. Tomorrow, I gotta run some errands too before it's time to go. Really not that much. Now that we got the liquor, that's one thing off my list. Figure out what I wanna do tomorrow. Drake, let me wear your chain. <laughs> okay, I come outside. Well, first of all, good morning. It is the morning of the concert. It's Tuesday the 11th, and we're going to Boston today to see Drake. If you made it this far in the video, you know we're going to see Drake. I had some errands to run this morning. I woke up, and y'all wouldn't believe the shock of my life. Someone tried to steal and break into my fucking car. I came downstairs, and I look in my car, and the whole bottom part of the steering wheel, that whole plastic area, is fucking gone. It got ripped off. Like, they were trying to fuck with the wires or trying to fuck with the, the key area. It's all busted up pictures around here but it's all fucked up and i'm like bro really they even tried to go in here to check if there was anything in here and now this is broken because like why would y'all my thing is why be so rough why be so rough because if you can't steal the fucking car it's left with all types of broken pieces and metal everywhere y'all they fuck the shit up they fuck the shit up they, fl they they ripped off my uh, Febreze thing. People have no respect. I'm telling you, if I ever caught them, yo, I like to beat people up for fun. I'm angry, but first of all, nothing can ruin my vibe because today we're going to go see Drake. And secondly, she still drives. So I'm very thankful and very happy about that because we're going to Boston still. <laughs> nothing could stop that we're we're going to boston still i just wanted to come and tell y'all to me that this is just fucking crazy i cannot believe they tried to break into my fucking car i mean it's not that i can't believe it it can happen to anyone or any time or whatever but <sighs> nobody expects it to happen nobody wants it to happen so anyways i'm at the nail salon i'm about to go in and see if they have any time for me to get a pedicure hopefully they're really quick because i want to be done with all my outside shit by two o'clock hey girl can you please put the cut water into the fridge and then i forgot to freeze the the water things to keep the i the um the the cut water cold yo whatever i'm just i'm just over it at this point not over it let me stop it's like i automatically say that i'm not over it i'm very happy i'm very happy very blessed very, very grateful i'm about to go get my toes done and y'all gonna come with me and let's go girl i know you wanna you know i wanna I went into CVS. I got some refreshers for me and my bed. I'm in a little bit of snack and the pound cake thing. I had to go into CVS to grab some essentials. I'm about to head home now. I think I told you guys in a nail salon that Miss Betsy does not lock. That's super frustrating. I'm just gonna head home now and it's almost one, which means I'm on good timing because I'm gonna get home, shower, and then, um, start getting ready okay you guys might hear a little bit noise in the background that's the ac but it's countdown time 
We're about to get ready, do our makeup. I'm so excited. Ah! Baby day! Oh, I can't take it. I'm so excited, y'all. I can't even speak for real. Girl's gonna lose her mind. I'm pretty sure mind. it's not gonna be just you. There's gonna be girls in there probably, yeah, losing their ever loving mind. Yep. And I'm gonna be number one. I'll tell you that much. You need a move there? Mm hmm. I don't play about my man. We're just gonna do a quick montage of makeup. Nothing crazy. I hope my makeup lasts the test of time tonight. We gonna see about that Charlotte Tillsbury. Yeah, let's go. Let's let's get ready for our, our baby daddy. I just want to say, if you were to ever fuck with a famous nigga, at some point, you can trust me and tell me all his business. I won't sell it to TMZ. I promise. Okay, you guys, my makeup is still sitting, still eating. So, we're in Boston. We're in traffic, because everybody's coming to see Sir 21 and drink. We're almost there, though. We have 15 minutes, it says, and I think that's because of the traffic. But, yeah, we're getting really close, really close. How you feeling, babe? I'm excited. I'm ready. I need these people to get the fuck out the way. Literally, we are the most important fans. Not anybody. We're else. the only important fans that are going yeah. to this concert. So I don't know why they just won't get the fuck. I got my little ring light. I'm about to take some pictures. I know it's looking real bright over here. Oh. But we made it. We made it on good timing. I'm happy about that. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys when we're parked to show off outfits. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey, hey. To the plane, to the truck, truck to the hotel lobby. Me, I go through underground garages, presidential suite on the plaza, elevator up to the room, shower up, and then we hit the club. Touchdown, gotta see what's up. Truck to the plane, to the truck, truck to the plane, to the truck, truck to the plane, to the truck, to the plane, to the truck. presidential suite. Oh, we out here. That's all I can say.
fucking concert. That was so fucking oh fun. I had a blast. Like, now we gotta run to our cars because right. everybody's dipping. Uh -uh. I'm drunk, y'all. Don't mind me. Not drunk, but I don't even know what I am. I think I'm just high. Yeah. Like, it was just such a good time. Seeing Drake, seeing 21, everybody had fun. Everybody was just vibing. You know, everybody was standing and dancing and singing. It was just nice. They really know how to put on the show. I tend to recommend if you can if you can go see Drake, even if you're in the very back, go see him. Go see him. Vibing. It was really good. I keep dropping y'all, I'm sorry. For the rest of my life, I'm going to all the Drake concerts. Even if he takes another five year hiatus, mm -hmm. I'm going in the next five It'll years. Be worth it. And he said in the concert that he's dropping a new album. Yeah, he said he's going to the studio tonight to finish up his album. I don't want to get copyright, so I'll talk to y'all later. Hey guys, what's up? It is now July the 12th. It is the day after the Drake concert. Boy, did we have a good time in this vlog. Let me tell you. I guess I just wanted to wrap up my thoughts about it. I said a little bit stuff, a little bit of stuff at the end of the concert, but I was so like tired and a little bit buzzed that I don't even remember what I really said and I don't even know if I said what I really wanted to, but at the end of the day, that concert was amazing. And if you have the means to go, I think you should definitely go. Drake did his thing, 21 did his thing. It was amazing, it was so fun. The vibes were all there. Everyone was just having a good time. And that's what I really like about concerts. People are typically like really in good spirits and are just happy to be there and happy to see one of their favorite artists. So it was that type of thing. If you made it all the way to the end of this vlog, thank you so much. You don't even know how much that means to me and i really hope that you enjoyed it as you were watching i'm trying to make it as entertaining and as fun as possible uh, hopefully you're able to tune in for the next video and i just want to say again thank you so much for watching and don't forget to comment rate and subscribe down below and tell me what you think about this vlog tell me what you think about drake in 21 21 tell me if you're going and i will see you guys in the next video bye it's high now She knows she working with the nana And she wanna give me the adunana Oh